Hey everyone, this is my reaction to the third episode of the second season of Don Machi. Now, last episode, Bell pretty much had a run for his life for the bulk of the episode because a certain familia you know, wants him, refuses to take no as an answer. Basically, you know, a small child tan temper tantrum version of f f familia, essentially. And, like, it doesn't matter how much you run away, how much you say no, eventually I'll wear you down and have you, you know, like a spoiled brat, essentially. But anyway, yeah, I mean, in the end, we decided to just have that ranking war, familia war battle, whatever they called it. We, I think we decided to do that in the end. And I think I, I might, might be doing a bit of uh, training to help him out a bit. Because they kind of need the help, because the Hestia familia is not exactly a big familia, so... We will gladly take whatever help we can get, so yeah, I hopefully we can make something work here because the odds are not in our favor, so let's just get into it and find out how it goes. Three, two, one, play. And people wanting the top quality drink, I see. Oh yeah, also, yeah, she got kidnapped. I don't know how I forgot about that. And probably because I wanted to forget about it. But yeah, some of familiar or whatever went after her. Little Lily. I wasn't missing, she left because you suck. Yes, that's the only request of hers that I ever want you to, to fulfill, so. Can you do that? Trying to leave. What, do you think familiars are optional? Well, people take my money, so. Good. Would you like to let me know what good he's done? I think that's too much. How about I let you live? Is that not payment enough? Well, then. Yeah, it does not seem like a great familiar either, but... Currently, I still like it better than a certain other familia. Apollo, I think it was. I keep forgetting about this cool shot here. Anyway, yeah, opening play, you know. Man, that Zetairi Oiki there is so beautiful. Whew. Eyes always looking so cool. It's definitely one of those ideas that I can never bring myself to skip. I just, I appreciate it too much. And we're back into it. Convention, conversion gathering. I can respect that. Well, yeah, I assume some sort of brainwashing was going on there. Well, she was Genki before you came along. Of course they did. Oh? Really? That's all it was? This was definitely planned in advance. What the heck are you talking about? The Hestia Familia is a very warm and welcoming place.
Okay. I guess that explains that. <sighs> yeah, I don't like that dynamic between you two. How about we just, like, stab you instead? That's what I would prefer. There's a manly man there. Ooh. Nice, uh, nice sword. War game, yeah, that's what they called it. So I guess Belle really is the only person with white hair in this show. That was the sound of something disconnecting. Hopefully it was nothing important. <sighs> okay, as long as we have a plan, let's go get Lily back. What cup size are you rocking? Well, we still care about Lily. We always have time for Lily. It'd be stupid. Lucky Bell. Yeah, that's who Bell is. Whew. Can't really argue with that logic, so let's go rescue our little pipsqueak. None of your business. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know the horrible thing you did? Remember that? Shush. Don't be mean to Hestia. No, I think that's you, actually. Some of those have to take no as an answer. Oh, Hestia, you, you shut up. You were just being mean to you. Perfect timing. You made plenty of things clear, dude. Freaking Loki. Yeah, so, like... That would make the most sense. That lazy, she just wants her familiar to double as her harem, basically. It's only almost so only got one person in it. I mean, if I was a god with a familiar, that's how I'd run things. Everyone in my familiar would be somebody I would want to bang, so. And it still wouldn't be the worst familiar, so. See, Joe! Made the jiggle. Man, those things really draw your attention. I'm sure they're just on the table like that. Well, you can try. That's not that not that much easier, but I guess that's something. Please do. A bit 
fit. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be fair. Don't be silly. <laughs> Getting provoked by uh, our sexy woman over there. Yeah, he's some kind of chicken boy. You do that yourself. Seems a bit unreasonable. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well said. Well, hopefully we can still get somebody decent. Yeah, are there any at all, really? Like any? Oh. Sure, she knows someone in mind. That's a good sign, but... Who? Of course, everything else is secondary to that. Has she escaped yet? That's a no. Well, they hurt SDI emotionally. Like I told you that. <laughs> you really just said that. I and mean, we all want those things, but it doesn't make it okay to do whatever you want. Yeet, wow, he did some real damage to those bars. Doesn't make it okay. Just because your god's a quiet type doesn't make you able to do whatever you want. Not how it works at all. I guess this is what happens when you have a very hands off gun. But he's a bad guy, so he doesn't have to follow rules or anything. Uh. Oh. <sighs> Chandra. Yeah, I don't like him at all. That guy's kind of a scumbag. Oh. Okay. I had a feeling he would help out. Something about his disposition just screamed to help her. So, uh, thanks for that, I guess. I think those crates were there. Okay, so they're coming. Okay. Well... I figured they would help with the operation. Well, definitely Wolf would, but... We're already in the middle of this. No, no backing down now. Even if you tell us to. You're in a cell talking through a tiny window standing on top of crates. You are not fine, Lily. We are taking you home. We're going to give you lots of hugs and head pats and you'll be fine. She's already pretty involved. No, even at times when she deserved to be abandoned, but we stuck with her. I mean, it's really a certain familia's fault, like all of this stuff. He is. He's doing his best. It's kind of his role the whole episode, just train. 
while everybody else handles the rest of it. You don't want to disappoint Bell, do you? Nice. <laughs> well... Uh, I don't want to see these things again. Because it's the truth. Apparently she can't handle the truth. Well... I don't think he does things aside from the... the Bruin. Well, I do. Rude. He's pouring the divine wine. That chat's a pretty hard challenge. That do you know what that wine does to people? But I, I guess I can see his mentality. Kind of funny when she says she has to drink it when there's tons of people that would pay almost any price to be able to drink it. And yet it's basically uh, like a challenge for her. Now we have a drunk Lily. Hopefully she can pull herself together and Request what she wants again. I kind of want some of it too, I'll be honest. Of course, Belle pops up in her head. Come on, Lily. You can get up. She's doing it. Okay, there's no need to exaggerate. Ugh. Definitely impressed that she can still do this after drinking it. He's got to respect that. <laughs> Thank you for telling him off. You can clearly see her conviction, so you can't ignore that. Oh, just breaking it like that. The god has spoken. Fighting is done. <laughs> My guy never does anything. How could he be doing things? This is ridiculous. Yeah, how about no? How about we stab you instead? Oh, I was hoping that would hit him, but oh well. Maybe, maybe Wolf will hit him. Well... I think we hit him a little bit. But it wasn't quite the decapitation I was hoping for, though. Yeah, we're coming home. Did well. Two things. We already established this doesn't do anything, and yet you want a second thing done? A little bit greedy there, Lily. Although I can get behind whatever this is. I guess we're actually transferring Familia here. So that's, I mean, we officially have her as part of the Hestia Familia, because that's awesome. He's definitely strong. <laughs> Maybe there's more to just more to life than just making alcohol, you know? No, it's a crazy thought, but
It won't, but I like how much it's helped us. Like, it's, it'll make a difference. Yeah, I mean, we accomplished what we wanted to today, so let's, let's go home, guys. We got Lily back. She's not part of the Hestia Familia, I think. And we're ready for the, the war game next episode, so let's see how we do. There we go. I knew that was coming at some point. I'm glad to hear that. You're pleased. You're more, more than welcome to join us. You are more than welcome to join the Hestia Familia. And yeah, it's all coming together now. Everyone that I've thought... Well, everyone that I wonder why they hadn't already joined is just about to join. Uh, well said. For Hestias, Hestias, I mean, that too. How our friendship and all that. Yeah, if she could join, that'd be very helpful. Ryu is quite powerful. I can't do that Mamma Mia thing seriously. I just can't. It sounds less silly in Japanese, you know, Mia Kasan, as she called it. Man, she is so good. And he's getting better, of course, but he's still nowhere near her level. Well, can't blame a man for jumping on your opening. That was a terrible joke, but I had to make it. It was just too perfect. I got I get it. Makes sense. Take notes, Bill. <sighs> That'll probably come in handy in the upcoming conflict. I'd be okay with that. He's definitely got another hand. Can you currently call yourself a goddess? Like, I'm pretty sure you're doing some pretty bad stuff. I mean, you don't have to be good, I guess, to be a god or whatever. Greek mythology taught me that pretty well. Uh, but yeah. Ugh, just so hot, sweaty. I hate summer. Just gotta love Lily's minimalistic amount of clothing. She, she, she makes it look good. Oh. Oh. War game. War game. I guess we're going to have the war game next episode. Okay. That was the third episode of the second season of Don Machi. Probably not going to talk a lot in this segment because I just, my voice is kind of starting to, starting to go on me. But basically, we rescued Lily. Lily pretty much overcame a lot in this episode. 
and was able to able to even earn the respect of her, you know, now previous former god, uh, Soma, and was able to actually switch over to the Hestia Familia, which is great. I mean, I just, I'm kind of surprised it took this long to do that, but I guess in Lily's case, it was difficult to do. Not so much for, like, uh, wealth and stuff, like, they just kind of had to ask, but with Lily, it was a bit more difficult. She actually had to go there and pass a bit of a trial and all that, but yeah, she did that. Wealth asked Hephaestus to switch Familia, because power of friendship and all that. And even, uh, what's her face asks Takemi Gazuchi to let her, you know, join the Hestia Familia. The only reason why I remember talking to Gazuchi's name is just because that was the name of a, a mech in Muvlov visual novel. Muvlov Alternative. That's the only reason why I remember that name. But, uh, because I just thought it was a pretty cool name. But, yeah, clearly it had, like, a godlike origin or whatever. But anyway, uh, yeah, that was that. We established some specifics on the war game. It was going to be a siege. We got to allow to have one outsider join, which I guess is going to be Ryu, it looks like, which is cool. I would love to see more of her. She was one of my favorite characters from season one, so I'm all happy to take more of her. And I guess that's in addition to these extra familiar members we're gaining, so that's uh, that's good. You know, that's good. If that's how it works, that's good, because then they got, like, the agreement, basically, was established before these extra familiar members, so it's almost a little bit like gaming the system a bit. But uh, it definitely even the odds a little bit. The odds, are still against, the odds are still against us, of course, but I like the chances better now than I did before. The next episode, we'll actually get to see how that goes down, so hopefully it goes well for, for us. Thank you for watching, and a special thanks to Snokey for supporting the channel. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you consider clicking the like button and leaving a comment, because that's a great and easy way to let me know that people want more. If you want to do something big to help the channel, you can support me on Patreon and get nice benefits like early access to certain videos. See you next time.